Hi, I'm Yasunor Yamamoto from Database Center for Life Science, and uh, I'm doing some everyday you know, typical processing stuff like uh, extracting some knowledge from papers, or, and also I'm doing some other stuff in Database Center for Life Science. And today I'm talking about uh, Umakayami data suit, and I, my plan in this hackathon. Yes, so um, I keep saying this every year, and this year I'm talking about this one first, and reduce, reuse, recycle. And I'm, this is, I think it's important for reducing the, uh, some redundancy in the database. If you use some database for intended redundance, for like, for like a backup on the resilience stuff, it's okay, but if there are some redundancies in the database, it's not so good. So I'm doing some uh, contribution to reducing the uh, redundancy of the database. And also reuse is very important. So it's the licensing stuff. If you use some licensing for uh, CC by two or something, it's okay. So it's very good for reusing the database. And for recycling, it's a kind of a, a bit uh, difficult in the, this uh, domain, but it, all the stuff for doing research is kind of recycling. So this is because you are doing research based on the previous uh, outcomes of the research, so it's kind of a recycling. So, so the, that comes in the Umaka suit here. The Umaka suit it consists of three components. Uh, the one is Umaka search, and two is Umaka viewer, and three is Umaka yami data. The first one is Umaka search. It is for people who want to wear the data I want. Uh, this is not yet open, and actually, the, recently I tried to make the indexing all the triples in the audio data, but you know there are a huge amount or number of triples, like 10 billion, 5 billion, 50 billion, so it's very difficult and unrealistic. So now I changed my mind and I tried to make some uh, compression for URI because in the RDF dataset, the RDF, uh, URI pattern is very simple. So maybe I think I can uh, compress dramatically for making some index for triples. So this is uh, my ongoing work. And also the second one is the Maca viewer. This is also a kind of uh, services for people wanting to know what the data structure is for a uh, data set. This is also an ongoing stuff, and it's uh, recently I opened this services. And the next one is the Umaka Yami data. It's already open, and there are many uh, problems. Uh, fix, uh, we need to something to fix the problems in this hackathon. So this is a uh, one side uh, image of the Umaka viewer. So you can. Ac uh, access for this URI if you want to see this one. This is an interactive map for uh, searching or viewing uh, the structure of a different data set. So this is one circle means one class, and if there's a subclass in within this uh, circle, you, you can see this one. Like, yeah, it's one class, and this class belongs to this larger circled class. So and uh, you can. Uh, Zooming in and zooming out by using a mouse or and, uh, just using your browser. Okay, this is a so, uh, concept of the Umaka uh, data. So this I want to make some community the, in the data database users and the providers. And also here is one example of the uh, monitoring result of the Yami data. So every day uh, the Yami data monitors the uh, endpoint. So this is kind of uh, uh, some example. So if you want to access this endpoint, so you can see if access here, you cannot access the service, but almost every day the service is up. And so you can see that kind of history of the services. So it, I think it's kind of, it, this is uh, important stuff to see every day if you want to know the reliability of the endpoint. And this is also uh, I, my plan in this hackathon for improving the Umakayami data. The first one is linked to other, uh, I have to make more 
link to a related databases. Like right? Intel Bio JP has many uh, directory of the database, so I want to make links for this kind of related database. And also this kind of stuff I have to do in this hackathon. Okay. Thank you very much.